Anthropology is taught as part of our forensic science course here. So what students will be learning first in lectures and later on when they use what they learn in lectures in the practical is how to analyze skeletal human remains, how to find out the sex of the person, the age, reconstruct the height that person had and look at other things like fractures, like pathologies, cause of death if it uh, manifests on the skeleton, things like that. The human remains collection we have here is from the Museum of Gloucester. We started a few years back with the first part of the collection which contains smaller kind of like burial contexts, individual skeletons or small collectives. And last year uh, we extended our collection here with what we see here in the background, which are remains that represent a complete collective or kind of like parts of a larger graveyard. The collection, like uh, this one here with the uh, skeletal human remains, is also used in context with projects. So I have some uh, projects that are osteology, so the analysis of uh, skeletal remains, of bones on one hand, and uh, DNA analysis in the ancient DNA context on the other hand, where parts of our collection are used for.